have you know, essentially the largest run of AOF on Long Island, uh, coming a quarter mile out of uh, the t tidal waters and getting stuck. And they want to go upstream. The more fish you get upstream, the more fish you get coming out, the bigger the population comes back the next year. These fish are helping to drive this coastal ecosystem. They're, as they come in, they're bringing all of the energy out of the ocean. Each female can lay a quarter million eggs, so they're dumping all this protein into the streams to help drive lots of uh, forage for lots of other species. Historically, all these dams that were built for ice harvesting, uh, to power mills, cranberry bog production, cut off habitat for these fish. And uh, what we're, we're trying to do is try to undo some of that and get these fish back. So in 2008, there was a rock ramp built at Grand Jebel Park, uh, that, that sort of stream looking thing that comes down through the park. These fish are not jumpers, but they're very capable swimmers, so they can swim up that ramp and they get into the Peconic. They come about a quarter mile up the stream here and they're stuck at this dam and they want to keep going. So one of the things we'd like to do is, is figure a way to get them past this dam into the county park here and open all this habitat up for them. Anytime you can increase the habitat for the alewives, it's really important. So they're right in the middle of the food chain, so obviously that's a very important uh, species. The results that we've seen at Argyle Lake and Babylon have been fantastic. Um, the, the, uh, the fish need to breed, and we need the fish to breed for the rest of the ecology here.